Martin. And this early glimpse of Mirandinha magic should have given Willie McFall's beleaguered side some encouragement. But seconds before the half-time whistle, Charlton striker Paul Williams added to the United boss's woes when he raced on to a Carl Lieburn pass to score despite Besant's despairing challenge. Six minutes after the restart, though, Charlton were down to ten men, defender Paul Miller having received his marching orders. And when Kenny Wharton's fine run produced a snap in for Darren Jackson, it looked as though Newcastle were about to make superior numbers count. And prospects of the season's first win shone brighter still when a superb ball from that man Berendinha gave defender Brian Tinian the chance to make it 2-1. Surely United wouldn't throw it away now. But the London side weren't finished and five minutes from time, Robert Lee latched on to Andy Thorne's attempted clearance to crash in Charlton's equaliser. 2-2 the final score.